Hi guys, welcome to piano log number 38. I have a surprise and this is Sebastian. Drum roll, yay. Sebastian is a gift from my, my Uncle Joe and thank you so much Uncle Joe if you're watching. It's always a pianist's dream to have a, a Steinway grand and I really can't believe it. I'm still processing it right now. So let's take a look. Let's have a Steinway tour. I'll take you guys. The model is Steinway B. Here's a serial number 52407. I don't know what this means, what the serial number means, but I knew, do know that B is the second, second largest. D is the largest, it's the concert grand. B is the uh, second largest, and then I believe there's A and O. So this is pretty big, uh, very big, and the year is 1992. So he's about three years older than me. Okay. All right, let's take, let's look at some other things. This is Sebastian in his proud mode. <laughs> uh, Steinway & Sons, New York, Hamburg. However, my piano teacher told me that if the sides are square like this, they're made in New York, and if they're rounded, they're in Hamburg. So I have a question. So this is Hamburg, but it's square. I'm a little confused about that rule. So if anyone has an explanation to that, go ahead and let me know. And uh, it's beautiful condition. This is a Steinway bench and you rotate it. It looks gorgeous, very elegant. And we got the pedals there. Beautiful liar. And that's it. This is matte, not shiny. It's very beautiful. And all the keys are there, very good condition. Sebastian was named after, can you guess, Johann Sebastian Bach. And my uncle's a big fan of Bach. And let's do some Bach, obviously, let's do some. A little rough right now, but working on it. Let's try some show up a pen waltz opus opus number sixty four number two. need tuning and whenever you transport a new piano into your home you must wait like at least two weeks to get let it get acclimated to the environment and then you can have it tuned so still needs a little bit of tuning but it's good enough for me and also I'm finding the keys are more difficult to well than my than my piano now they're more difficult to press down so I need to get some more strength in my fingers to play this piece correctly. Um, so that's good for, you know, finger strength. I definitely want to do this justice. 
um, because it's a grand piano and I feel like I need to, you know, be a grand piano playing level. Anyway, thank you for joining me. I'm glad I can introduce you to Sebastian. Um, he's a living things person. I feel like pianos have their own personality and they're all, they're all different. Okay, I'll see you next time. Bye.